head on over to greenmangaming.com. Happy Thanksgiving, by the way. Uh, why don't you treat yourself to some of their Black Friday deals on this today Thanksgiving. Just head down to the description. Uh, where are we? We're still trying to get to our overall destination, which is uh, somewhere seven jumps away. Uh, and our next waypoint is 20342. But I'll tell you what I've been doing. I've been gathering survey data all the way there. First, is there a station nearby? There's not. This entire sector is unexplored. Alright. Let's see here. Oh, turn the goddamn scanner on. Okay, for some reason the system scanner doesn't want to work. With the X. Alright, that should be good now. It isn't, apparently. Okay. I think it's because this thing is just on. Also, I've been doing this. Been slowly filling back up our tanks on the way there. You think I give a shit about the heat? I can take the heat. Right, that's a little too much. That's a little too much. Okay. Let her cool down. What's that thing? I don't know. Ooh. Looks good. Let's see what it is. <laughs> yeah, I've been fiddling with the controls. It's getting better. I just added a button for the cargo scoop. Which means we can steal things once we blow people up. It'll be slow going. Well, we just passed the orbit of something. All right, where exactly does this planet reside currently? I think we could gain survey data while we're orbiting this planet. We've discovered it. Doesn't say it's a garden planet exactly. It's a rocky ice world. <laughs> it's a rocky ice planet. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, let's try one of those two. Preferably something close ish. That's 633 light seconds away. You did target it, yeah? How do I know that? I think that's the sun. Whoops. Ah, fuck. Okay. I definitely hit the wrong button. I think I just broke something. Alright, hang on. Where was that thing again? I don't know, my goddamn engine's on cooldown. At least now we could get the goddamn scanner working. There are twelve. We need more scanners. A lot more. 
Activate friendship drive. Alright. Where to next? That one. That one's relatively close. Boom. Alright. Assist activated. We're on our way. It says 30 seconds, but I don't believe it. It starts to slow down as we get close. I suppose if I just took the helm and did flybys, that would work. Just do flybys at full speed. I'm not exactly fixing to land on these planets. Unless we get something interesting. New signal source. Alright. What do we got? Aliens! Another rocky ice planet. Shite. How is that one so damn far away, and how fast can I rocket myself towards it? Do that one. That one's close. Yeah, just keep increasing speed perpetually until we're going so fast it, it it's uh, it's honestly stupid uncomfortable. If we slam into anything, it's gonna be a bug on the windshield type situation. Only it's a race car. Powered by a rocket. <laughs> we'll die is basically what I'm saying. When you achieve speeds such as this, you uh, run into the problem of... Basically, if you slam into a grain of sand at this speed, it is the equivalent of a hundred thousand tons of TNT being detonated all at once. And you're not coming back from that. Alright, let's see what we got here. Coming in too fast. A little fast. It's an ice planet. Great. Alright, let's do one more. Just keep flying past these things. The stupid planets. It's not like there's any good ones out here. A lot of sci-fi would have you believe otherwise. And, oh no, the Stargate's like, ah, oh, no, there's, there's trees everywhere. <laughs> Star Trek is like, the entire planet's made of rocks. Let's breathe. <laughs> yeah, slow down indeed. I'm gonna get as close as I can to this thing. Where'd it go? I think it's another ice planet. That or it's a rock. Here it is. What do we got? Ice planet or rock? Can we terraform it? I don't think we can. I was thinking of bringing us into an orbit. Uh, I'll settle for a closer flyby for now. That's a rock. Alright. I'm good. <laughs> Shit. Alright. Next.
galaxy map, please. It's that one. That one is the destination. Alright. After hip 20342, we should get... Oh, wait. Apparently the economy here is in a state of boom. There might actually be some place we can... We can stop and get our fuel back up. Where's the thing? Just do a big spin. It's usually how you find. There it is. Throttling up. I am actually carrying eight tons of copper right now because I figured I would be able to sell it. It was cheap copper, too. <laughs> I hello. Okay, let's see what we got here. Belt clusters. this medium security facility. And this... It's all mercenary work. God damn it, are you kidding me? Gordon Barracks. That might be our best bet. What else is here? There is... a lot here, actually. Wait, here we go. That's what we're looking for. Anytime we can avoid landing, I'm going to avoid landing. Oh, who is this? Uh, do its thing, I guess. I think that's a ringed planet out there, though. <laughs> Jesus. Fortunately, um... It's unfortunately, for those of you who didn't hear the first part. Unfortunately... Chances are everything has been discovered because there's a million bases around here. They're like, we know where that is, we know where that is. Oh, we I know we mapped this whole damn place before you even got here. Yeah. You, you, you sure is stupid. <laughs> uh, fucking pay me. <laughs> I don't know why, just pay me. Fuck. I feel like, uh, it, feel, I f it feels like I'm in the credit sequence of LEGO Rock Raiders. Can we do that? Can we be the Rock Raiders in this game? We just teleport down into caves and stuff. Get a Chrome Crusher. They still got copyright on Rock Raiders, you think? I don't know, what do you think? I think they held on to that copyright. Or trademark. Trademarked Rock Raiders. They moved on to Power Miners. Cool. Big ol' ringed planet. 
I just went through like 15 unexplored sectors and didn't get to see any of that cool shit. Comet. Or something. I think it's a comet. Should be doing that this close, though? Fucking comet. How do they work? Comets. Comets. We need to figure out how those work. Oh, oh, hi. Yeah, I'm coming at you. Zorgon Peterson, Hotel Uniform, November. Please follow standard docking procedures by order of the Imperial Flight Operations Bureau. By order of the Imperial Flight Operations Bureau. Oh, God, for me, God, God, be it for me to upset the... Federal Flight Regulations Bureau, or whatever the fuck you just said. Pad number 43, Jesus. You know, I can't help but notice we seem to be getting a bit further away from the station. That's a trail of dust. Why is there a trail of dust? Hey, look at this. Ads! Like a fucking... Space Mickey D's or something. Only the Empire can show you the way. Yeah, I, I doubt that. Robots. Fucking space billboards. Tell you guys to go to McDonald's. Oh, I'm sure we can find ourselves a job around here somewhere. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a real good landing right there. Landing successful. You may alight when ready. Welcome to the facility, Commander. Don't you sound like a pompous ass? <laughs> Don't forget to spend all your money here. Be sure to visit the gift shop for all kinds of cheap, useless stuff. Let's see if we can sell this for a good price. Copper, 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 copper. Well, that's a financial gain. Yeah, I'll take it. At the very least, it'll pay for the fuel that I used to get here. Alright, going to the other stuff. What do we got here? Minerals are usually a very safe thing to bet your money on. Don't see any, though. They do not want survival equipment. <laughs> With regret, we must inform pilots that unauthorized docking bay access is unacceptable and will dictate an appropriate response. Well, that's an interesting thing to broadcast. <laughs> you just catch somebody? Why would I buy scrap and bio waste? <laughs> Let's do tons of medicine. We would like to thank pilots for their promptness. You could drag that over to the Gordon barracks. Nah, we'll just take it with us. All right, I'm making a gamble on that. Wait, go back. Did that just say Imperial Slaves? Yes, it did. There's a slave market in this game, folks. 
Slavery is an important part of imperial society, providing labor for the empire and a safety net for its citizens. Many imperials will choose to sell themselves into a fixed period of slavery rather than face the embarrassment and dishonor of living with a debt. I know who we're saving the galaxy from. <laughs> I think we're gonna have to save it from these folks. What ships you got? 18. Including the Imperial Cutter and the Beluga Liner. Type 9 Heavy, Orca, the Imperial Clipper, ASP Explorer, the Imperial Cor Courier, Dolphin. Type 9 Viper, Cobra, Viper, the Imperial Eagle, our current ship, the Hauler, a regular eagle and a sidewinder. Because, of course, they have the sidewinder. That cheap old stupid thing. <laughs> what a cheap old dumb looking ship that was, wasn't it, folks? <sighs> Mission board. Where are we going next? Navigation, galaxy map. Sangadia is our next destination. All right, Sangadia. Sangadia. For a second there, I thought that said Camino, and I got really excited. What's our destination again? 21991. None of these. Once again, nobody wants business where I'm going. I'm not going to Camel Toe. Uh. Okay, so we're not taking jobs. We're gonna have to rely on the fact that we're carrying goods. Just see if we can pawn these off as we keep going. Cartographics. Sell some of this too. Jesus Christ. All right, we stand to make a lot of money off of all the data that I've gathered. Nice. How'd that do for my Explorer ranking? Mm, still mostly aimless. Trade rank is getting better, though. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And our plush bank account. Is quite the indicator of that. I'm gonna own the economy of the world by the time I'm done. Of the galaxy. I'm going to own the galaxy. Alright, let's see. Core systems. Let's see if we can get some upgrades here. Maybe even a fuel tank. Alright, nothing better than what we currently have, which is a capacity 8. Sensors, though. Nothing's, nothing that isn't going to completely destroy our power needs. This would do it, but it would severely limit the amount of distance we can cover. I'm 
make do for now. Power distributors. I keep wondering if we can solve the power problems. Frame shift. We could get a 3A. It would be stupid expensive and we can't actually afford it. <laughs> Why is it even highlighted? Anything I can't afford should display as red. Yeah, I poured a lot of money into the 3B. It's just one step away from the 3A. available here for external pulse wave analyzers, ECMs, kill warrant scanners, manifest scanners. What about the wake scanners? Calculate the destination of a hyperspace jump. Basically, it means we can track people. Used to detect anomalous readings within solid objects. More specifically, within asteroid fields. Our ship needs to be condemned <laughs> by this. Supposedly, we're going to be mining asteroids, so we're, we're going to need something like that. All right. Show me those power plants again, because that 3C is looking really, really enticing. I'm buying it. Fuck it, I'm buying it. It's not that much. And with that, we can actually go back to look at guns. Okay. I wanted a much bigger main cannon. Two F burst laser. What about a pulse laser? That would up the thermal load to 63. Trying not to burn to death in the ship. Oh, if we got this, it would be down 42%. <clears throat> That's not bad. Let me think about that. What about, like, just a big mining laser. Like, real big. <sighs> Seismic charge launcher. Oh, I think what we need is a laser. We'll have to figure it out when we get to wherever we're going. We should definitely get and consider a railgun at some point, though, Jesus Christ.
Alright, well, that was fun, wasn't it? Oh, great. Fire groups. What did you mess up? I had them all figured out. What did you do? Oh, right, the pulse wave. Put that on this one. The data link, composition, discovery. I have way too many action groups here. All right. Right. Let's get the hell out of here in the slave city. Yeah, I'm still thinking about that. Hope they're at least treated with basic human dignity. Uncoupling sequence complete. Depart when ready. Who do we align with now? We can't go with the Empire, they're assholes. Which is a shame, because I didn't want them to be. I'm just, now I just feel compelled to, to, I feel dirty, you know? I feel dirty. <laughs> like knowing that those guys are paired in with common cargo. You know what I feel? You get it. We all hate slavery. At least I hope we all do. If you don't, what's wrong with you? <sighs> I got it from here, guys. Thanks. I'm just gonna fly in a single direction and then... Where are we going from here? This place is definitely worth revisiting, though. Go ahead and bookmark this place. Exploited. Yeah, da goddamn right. From the looks of it, at least, where we're going is on the edge of em Imperial control. All this purple crap is the Empire. Green is the Alliance. They're huge, aren't they? Maybe we should link up with them. That's just barely the edge of Imperial control. And if the Empire shows up, then all our plans are gonna suck then, aren't they? Yellow might be a good place to take refuge for a while. I'm considering war options. Why did you... Oh. I thought you went to some stupid system. Alright. Target locked. It's not locked locked. But let's see. Here we go. Engage friendship drive. There it is. Look at that. I like how the first thing it says is fear. Get our bearings. What's our status? Uh, and will they buy the crap that I bought off the other people? Unlikely. This entire sector seems unexplored. Hey, 
Activate system scan. Give us a full topography. 32 bodies, Jesus Christ. We just discovered like three planets just by scanning. <laughs> oh. Oh, if I a I be There aren't any proper stations nearby. Befehl nicht ausführbar. Hmm. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> Activate friendship drive. Hanging out in the inner Orion spur. Throttling up. Fear. <laughs> you will fear this machine. All will fear this machine. Or maybe not this machine. We definitely need a bigger ship. There's a little miniature. Yeah, that one. Let's get that. Way on the end there. Activate scan. What do we got here? Orbital plane established. All right. Give me an idea of what's in the area. Some nav beacons, unidentified signal source. Some relay stations. They could probably use meds. What? A line. Okay. That sounded like there was something wrong, like they were on the other side of the sun or something stupid. I'm just trying to offload a few meds. Where the hell is this stupid station? Oh, there it is. Ay, ay, ay. All right, head over to Libby. Yes, Libby. Cruise ship just called me, apparently. I hearing? That's not my ship. Is that the cruise ship? No way we're heading to the same place. I was thinking though, at some point maybe we should get in the market of moving people. I don't mean slaves. Obviously not. Jesus, you guys, I mean, due to some unforeseen delays, we will be arriving at our next destination later than scheduled. Oh, well, you suck then. <laughs> All right, head on over to Libby. Somehow the planet it's next to hasn't been explored. Weird. We're in a shipping lane means we're liable to be pulled out of hyperspace and be sacked for our medicines. Alright, we're apparently about to discover this entire planet cluster. This consists of one planet and multiple moons, I think. Relay. 
fuck are you, Relay? How much further do I have to fly, Relay? Is that an ice moon? It looks like Duna from KSP if Duna was blue. Because because of the poles, mostly. It's really the poles. That is actually a cool-ass planet. Is it all ocean? I think it's all ocean. God, none of these planets are in the Goldilocks zone. We need something to to sell. We need to sell a garden planet, and then they need to let me name it. Because I I found it. <laughs> That's all we gotta do. That's what we gotta do. Alright. Let's land. Alright. Landing pad one. Oh, priority access. I get the first one. Auto docking on the at the dock. Go to the dock and dock the ship. Dock the ship. Dock dock the ship. Land the ship. Land land the ship. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Well, we're here, ish. This area is still part of the Empire. I uh, I told you guys my goal is to leave the Empire. Right, sell medicine. That's a good profit, actually. Yeah, sure. All right, what do you got? Uranium. Average price of that is super shitty. Could try copper. Copper's a good bet. Gold. Palladium. Palladium. Hmm. Maybe palladium? Liquid oxygen. That's something I actually know what it is. Polymer, if KSP, not KSP, Surviving Mars is anything to go off of, we know that we have problems with Polymer. <laughs> if they were episode names, half of them would be called the recurring Polymer problem. <laughs> Can we do that, actually? Indium, lithium, palladium, palladium. I'm thinking palladium. Let's do titanium. Yeah, what he said. Uh, <laughs> Gas us up. Uh, check the cartographer, see if we're far enough away from those uh, we are. That's good, at least we're making money off that one, that deal we just made. For the titanium. Mission board, please. Where am I in route to? Glees 3318. Here we go. Massacre people. <laughs> what do I need to do? Eliminate two pirates. They'll be there. Search local arrest sites, nav beacons, and signal sources. 
No, I can't come back to the Libby Reed. I, the, the, the rules are I'm not coming back. Take down one guy. Mm, probably too hard. I'm gonna read all of these though. Assassinate another pirate. Oh god. Running out of people here. Massacre more people. <laughs> Eliminate two deserters. I'm not gonna search the whole damn system. These guys just want pirates killed. God. Is anyone going there? Like, people-wise? I don't have any cabins, but... Let's see. Does not react well to danger. Danger, danger, danger. Delays will dramatically reduce the passenger satisfaction. All right, what do I need to do here? Transport a celebrity to LHS. Okay, it's a specific destination. You know. No, thank you. I don't have cabins either. That could be a problem. Anyway, we got our cargo, we got our fuel, I guess we can leave. Why are we going down? Why do we have to go down to spin? Okay, the moment I get to a shipyard, we're gonna finally change that to English. <laughs> uh, I, I've had enough with the German. Alright, next destination is Galize. Galize 331. We're still mass locked, so give me a minute. Thermal dynamics are holding up pretty okay. We're only at 28%. There it is. Alright. We're throttled up. We are aimed at it. We just need it to charge, and we're on our way. Excellent. And all my bobbleheads go crazy when that happens. Because, I don't know, there's gravity or something stupid on the ship. <laughs> something stupid that gives the ship gravity. Alright. Bearings. Scanner. Discovered a belt cluster. And another one. And another one. Three belt clusters. That's not bad. Multiple resource extraction sites. We could just make our way to Mokujin. It's right there. <coughs> There's nowhere to really land here. Land and offload some stuff. 
Let's head to Moku. All right, we're on our way. How many more jumps to... Oh, close. I think we're actually almost out of Imperial space, yeah, if not cool. already. see what the next one has in store for us. <laughs>